excellent habitat for bird watching. And, uh, we have an awesome nature center with a lot of kids that get to enjoy the outdoors and they're running around the trails today. Uh, we have a group from Harrisburg that are studying nature so it's, it's a good opportunity to get outside and enjoy the outdoors. Uh, some things to do in, in the park. There's six miles of trails, 90 acre freshwater marsh. Uh, in fact the marsh has been changing over the years and we're a little concerned about that because uh, it's gone from a lake called Wildwood Lake to the, the shallow marsh habitat. And that's one thing that has changed. We're working now to see what we can do about that. We want to preserve Wildwood long-term as a great destination for people and wildlife. So we want to keep it your walking destination, but we also want to make sure that the wetland doesn't just fill up with mud and turn into a wet meadow. And then eventually you have trees like behind me that grow out of it. In fact, a hundred years ago, when the park was initially created in 1907 this was lake and this is an area where people would come and spend time even in the winter ice skating uh, recreating boating in the summer and now it's become what's known as a delta or it's full of sediment uh, over decades and decades where you have trees that are starting to take root and this is in fact what happens this is the natural progression of, of lakes filling with sediment so it's one thing we talked about today 